What's going on gamers? Today we're going to be going over how to install and use Paper MC on your Apex Minecraft server. Before we get into this tutorial, don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you can stay up to date on every tutorial we upload just like this one. In more recent server versions of Minecraft, it's become increasingly and annoyingly difficult for the game to stay optimized with large amounts of concurrent players. Alongside this, vanilla Minecraft often suffers from basic moderation, as there are limited commands that server staff can have. Introducing Paper, a fork of Spigot that dedicates itself to bringing improved performance and tons of new features to servers. Paper MC allows the use of both Spigot and Bucket plugins as well as offering a wide selection of configuration options to overall improve gameplay and customization. And today, we're going to show you how to get started with Paper. Installing on the panel is ridiculously easy. Just hop onto your panel and then stop your server or don't and scroll down to the jar file selection. It might say game file and then just click on it. And this is going to open the drop down. From here, you can search for paper and type that in or scroll up or down to find your specific version of Minecraft that you'd like. When prompted, it's going to ask you to change version and then it's going to ask you to create a new world when prompted and then it's going to ask you to restart. Here, all you need to do is click on restart and once it's online, it should be running paper. And installing manually is just as easy. If you want to install a specific version instead of the latest one, you can install any version of Paper MC as a custom jar. We actually have a tutorial on how to install custom jars, which of course is going to be linked in the description of this video. Just scroll down to the jar file selection as before and click on it and type in custom jar. It's going to ask you to change version and it's going to say you should generate a new world and then it's going to ask you to restart. Go ahead and click on FTP file access on the left and log in with your information. And you're going to see a folder that says jar. Go ahead and click into it. Once you're in the folder, click on upload at the top left. And then open up the folder or location that you have your custom.jar file at. Now this can be any jar that you just rename to custom.jar by right clicking and then clicking on rename and then typing in c-u-s-t-o-m dot jar. And then you hit enter and it renames a jar for you. Now all you need to do is click and drag this jar from wherever it is over to your server panel page where it says drag here to upload. Once it's uploaded at 100%, you can click on the name of your server at the top of the page to return. And then once you're here, go ahead and click restart. And now we're going to go over some paper configuration options. There are tons of paper configuration options. So for the full list, go ahead and consider visiting the official documentation page, which of course is going to be linked in the description below this video. And then now we can get into accessing the configuration. Go ahead and on your server panel page, Go ahead and stop your server if it's online. Now, remember, we always want to have our server offline when we're making changes. Once your server does say offline, go ahead and click on FTP file access on the left and log in with your information. Scroll down until you find the paper.yml file and then to the very right of it on the same line, there should be an edit button. When you click on it, you can go here to make any configurations in regards and in association with the official documentation that we linked below this video. You can use this to your best ability to make your server the coolest. Overall, Paper MC is a great server option for those that want to play with many players, plugins, and still want control over what can or can't be done. Paper is constantly being updated with new fixes, patches, and even the smallest of bugs can be fixed in the same version. If you're interested in joining the paper community, you would visit their page, of course, linked in the description of this video with their Discord, 
which has a ton of nerds who would love to help you out with your server, and so on and so forth. Well, folks, that's all we've got for you today, and as always, we hope you have lots of fun. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more great content like this, then subscribe or click these videos. Until next time, gamers.